nobody coming through in lane number two. It's of no value to the truck in front to put a right signal on because I couldn't see his mirrors, so therefore he couldn't see me. And I've still got about four or five car lengths behind the articulating truck, so he's got plenty of time to notice me building up my speed. I'm doing 60, 61, 63, getting past the truck. And then once I'm past him, checking the centre mirror and the left mirror. And if I can see the face of the truck in both of those, then I don't need a signal to come back to the left. To illustrate an overtake here, I'm catching up the back end of the silver car behind. So I check my centre mirror before I let my speed drop slightly. Check my right mirror, there's nobody over there. But I'm close enough now that I want to put a signal on to draw the attention of the driver of the silver car to let them know that I'm changing my position behind. They're not catching up the black taxi in front of them, but if the taxi was a little bit closer to them, it would be even more important for me to put my signal on to let them know that I'm moving out. Similarly, I can see the face of the silver car in the centre mirror, as well as in the left mirror, so I don't need a signal before moving back to the left. If I have to come left sooner than that, and I can only see the face of the one I've overtaken in my left mirror, yes, in my left mirror, not yet in the centre mirror, then I should put a signal on to come left. Easing off my gas so that I'm not catching up the trailer vehicle now. And it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to realistically overtake that van because the trailer isn't picking up speed fast enough, so I'll check my left mirror to make sure it's safe to come back across to lane one. I can check my gear as well. Looking well ahead, there's plenty of clear road ahead. The vehicle towing the trailer has pulled back in, but I've got a taxi coming past in lane two, so I'm easing off my gas not to shrink the space between me and the van in front. I don't want to get lower than a two second gap, that would be safe. Recheck my centre and right mirror, put a signal on, because the driver of that van can see me in his mirror, I can see his mirror so he can see me, and then I can build my speed up again moving up through the early 60s, up to 65, now I'm past him, checking the left mirror, I can see the face of him, I can also see the face of the centre mirror, but I've got enough speed to probably overtake this silver car as well that's towing the trailer, so I'll keep adding a little bit of gas, 66, 67, we're catching up the trailer at at least a walking pace, so it's reasonable to stay out of this lane and be aiming for an overtake at at least a walking pace faster than their truck. Still doing 67, easing off the gas a tiny bit because our road stuck the slope downhill. But alongside the silver car with the trailer, checking the left mirror, he's holding his position, checking the centre mirror, I can see his face, so I don't need a signal 